Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. If you're new to teal hunting this year or maybe you're from a state such as Minnesota where they're having their very first teal season this year, stay tuned because I'm going to give you some calling tips utilizing the teal calls. Okay guys, so I've been asked several times um, over the course of the year, uh, do I use teal calls? Uh, yes, I do. Uh, I utilize two uh, calls. Both of them are from Duck Commander. And just to let you know right now, I am not affiliated with Duck Commander. Uh, I like their calls. Um, they sound good. They work good. Uh, there are other companies that make teal calls, but I just happen to like Duck Commander. So we're going to start for the, with the first call. And this is the 6-in-1 call it's uh it can it can do a pintail a widgeon uh, of course the teal and you can make a drake mallard sound out of it it's a very versatile call now when i'm blowing this call i'm only going to blow this call at green wing teal and the reason is uh blue wing teal drakes uh do not um they don't talk that much the green wing teal drake does. So all I'm gonna do is just do a little peep, a little series of peeps. And how I do that is I take the tip of my tongue, I put it to the roof of my mouth, and I just blow straight air. That's all I'm doing. It's gonna and that's it. Like I said, the green wing teal, Drake, is he's the only one that's going to make that noise. Uh, I don't have cinnamon teal where I'm at in South Carolina, so I don't know the, if the Drakes sound off or not. But I know if I've, I got, if I've got green wing teal in the area, I am going to blow this call. The next one is the teal hen call. Again, this is made by Duck Commander. Now with the teal hen, uh, your cadence is very similar to that of a mallard duck call, a mallard hen duck call. Uh, but it's going to be shorter and it's going to be more choppy. So it's, it's almost like a laugh if you can um, understand that. Uh, it's just kick, 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 and that's it. That's what they do. Uh, there's no single quacks that I've ever heard. Uh, they do not do a feed chuckle, and they don't do that long, drawn-out uh, hail call that you will do on a mallard call. It's just very, very short, uh, very choppy. Sounds a little something like this. And that's it. Now, I utilize that call when I see the, the teal off in the distance. I want to get their attention. So I'll hit that uh, three, four, five, however many times I think I need to do it until they start getting closer. So once I get them to turn and come in, what I'm going to do next is just a little, what, what I consider a choppy, quack or a fast quack um she doesn't do a, a single quack uh she just kind of does a little little choppy quack uh it's a little bit slower than the call that i did before but it um just kind of goes a little something like this this is when they're all coming in And that's about it so if they get closer and they, they just don't quite do it and they start to flare off and start to go around then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go right back to that first call and as they get back a little bit closer then it's just going right back to the same thing and guys that's it like I said, if you're new to teal hunting, or if you're in one of the states that have just introduced teal season for the first time this year, 
I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it helps you out. And guys, we will see y'all next time on Daddy Duck 365.